shocking inside job caught on tape. A Toys R Us manager in a suburban Buffalo behind bars this morning charged after murder after an assistant apparently walked in on him while he was allegedly trying to steal from his own store. ABC's Gio Benitez has the story. Outside this Toys R Us store, employees console each other following the murder of 35-year-old assistant manager Larry Wells, a father of a four-year-old little girl. But look again, because this morning, police say this man is actually his killer. It happened early on a Saturday morning in June. Police say this man, sporting a baseball cap, got into the store at 4.20 a.m. using a key and walked into the manager's office to steal. Roughly seven minutes later, the video system was disabled from within that office. Moments later, Wells reportedly walked in, and that's when police say he was stabbed to death. The case went cold for four months. The hunt is on for the man who killed a Toys R Us assistant manager. But now police say that man showing grief outside the store is the same person seen on that surveillance video. 38-year-old Bernard Grusha, Wells' boss, the regional manager for Toys R Us. Ironically, he's in charge of loss prevention at the stores. There's several pieces of evidence uh, that, that kind of st started stacking up that led us to him. Among the clues, remember that baseball cap seen on the surveillance tape? It was found at the crime scene. There was several DNA samples taken, but I can't comment on whether or not that, that matched. But why would Grusha, who had once lived in this upscale home, be allegedly stealing from his own store? Police believe he got into financial trouble following his divorce. Overnight, his lawyer telling ABC News, Bernard Grusha did not murder Larry Wells, and we are confident that he will be vindicated at trial. And Wells's family telling us he was an amazing person, a wonderful husband, and the best father. We miss him every day. And Grusha has pleaded not guilty to second-degree murder. He'll be in court later this morning. And there have been other burglaries at Toys R Us stores in his region, but police have not tied them to the executive. Elizabeth, Elizabeth George. All right, Gio, thank you so much.